Three White County teens driving home from prom were killed Sunday in a distracted driving crash in Lafayette, officials said. The driver of a Pontiac Grand Prix veered off South River Road while checking a popular social media app, Snapchat, then steered right into an oncoming 18-wheeler as they drove home from after prom located at the Purdue Memorial Union bowling alley. The teens were reportedly Snapchatting with several friends just prior to the crash that took the lives of three teens. Snapchat has come under scrutiny lately due to the speed filter on their app. It is frequently reported teens are trying to compete with one another on getting the fastest speed while driving. <clears throat> Several recent teen deaths have been linked with Snapchat. In January of this year, a judge dismissed claims against Snapchat that blamed the social media's company, Speed Filter, for a highway crash. The judge said the Communications Decency Act provides the social media company with immunity. With the growing number of smartphones and other consumer electronics today, particularly among teens, the number of injuries and fatalities from distracted driving accidents do not appear to be slowing down anytime soon. According to the CDC, teen drivers are more likely to underestimate dangerous driving situations than older drivers with more experience on the road, and that danger is compounded with the popularity of certain smartphone apps that encourage teen drivers to multitask behind the wheel. Cody Loy, 18, Aubrey Douglas, 18, and Casey Clapper, 16, died of their injuries at the scene. A fourth passenger, Casey Fryer, who was also 16, was critically injured but stable, according to authorities. Indiana State Police investigators are reviewing the collision, which did not injure the driver of the truck. All teens involved in the accident all attended Frontier Junior Senior High School, according to the Frontier School Corporation website. We extend our support and sympathy to the families and friends of these students as well as both to both communities and the corporation as a whole, Frontier School Principal Jeff Henger said in a statement Monday. Counselors are at Frontier Junior Senior High School this week to provide support to students and staff. It wasn't immediately clear who was driving the car early Sunday morning and the Indiana State Police didn't immediately respond to our request for more information. Distracted driving is the number one killer of American teens, according to the Indiana State Police. Ironically, the three teens that died are National Honor Society members at Frontier and played a major role in the Every 15 Minutes Distracted Driving program held at Frontier just this past Thursday. Cody Loy was a senior at Frontier. Cody was a top-notch student involved in Student Council, Business Professionals of America, National Technical Honor Society, and Fellowship of Christian Athletes. He played varsity golf and was looking forward to attending Ball State University where he planned on being a chemistry teacher and set with uh, secondary education. Aubrey Douglas, who is also a senior at Frontier, had plans to attend Indiana University to study human biology. Aubrey wanted to be a doctor. She was a cheerleader at Frontier and was a member of the Business Professionals of America, Student Council, Sunshine Society. She was also the editor of Frontier's yearbook. Casey Clapper, a sophomore at Frontier, was committed to play softball at IU, Indiana University, as a freshman. She was a member of the softball team that made it to semi-state last year. Indiana University's coach, Michelle Gardner, released a statement stating that she had worked with Casey many times and was looking forward to having her be a part of the team. She said it's rare to find a commit with grades, character, and talent like she found in Casey. As of Monday evening, there was no word on the condition of the only survivor, Casey Fryer.